I'm gonna talk about my brand new rig. What I mean by rig is that I bought the pieces I wanted to buy to make my recording setup for these videos the way I want it to be, and they've all finally arrived. Much heartache at some points, but they've all finally arrived, and they're here, and I'm gonna do a review about it. <laughs> well, you gotta try. In honor of Oscar, I'm eating a fig Newton. Mmm, tastes like figs. It's actually good. Filling up on coffee. I brought a mirror. It's been like a long couple weeks trying to get all the pieces that I need. I tried to make this video before, like back then, like two or three weeks ago. There's a lot of excited footage. There's a lot of really disappointed footage. So I figured I'd just start fresh. First and foremost, I use my phone as the video camera. This is pretty important to me because I want this to be as easy of a process as possible. I want there to be no hangups, no excuses, nothing. So I'm using my phone. I've found a few drawbacks. The first one is I can't film any footage of me on the phone. Drawback two, I can't use my phone to research anything or look anything up or remind myself of anything while I'm recording. Drawback number three, if the phone screen sits in the sun, it'll shut off my recording. Other than that, I freaking love it. The next best thing that I love is this Joby tripod. It looks kind of wonky. It's got these you know weird beads. You can wrap it around anything and film from anywhere and then they all come together really easily to be a handheld selfie stick. The next thing I have is this thing. It's kind of hard to see right now. I'll do a picture of it. This thing right now here it's called a glyph. What it does is it holds my phone securely and safely and like locks it in place. I love this thing. I want like three more of them. The next thing I had to get was this um, double wing. It's the tripod adapter. I had to create a little rubber washer in here um, to hold it secure and hold the microphone at the right angle. I had a Rode microphone from our bigger camera setup and there were a couple problems with it. One, it was really invasive, like it was big. And it took a battery, so I had to like carry extra batteries with me and make sure I turned it on and off. This one doesn't take a battery, it uses the battery in the phone as the power source. Um, and it's smaller, more compact. Next is like this contentious piece right here. This is the most disappointing piece. This is the piece I'm mad at most. Um, it took the longest to get in the mail. It's an adapter to make this microphone work with a smartphone. And that was just the most frustrating thing. I just have the whole setup ready and I need this like two inch adapter. The next thing is something super annoying as well, which is this dongle to change the um, headphones plug-in into the iPhone lightning whatever plug-in. I just wish I had a headphone jack. So here's what the microphone looks like. Here's that glyph piece I was talking about. Stretch it like this, snap your phone in there, and I should get a pager. Wow, wow.